will hold the back stripe. We'll get a lap in. No. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Well, how about this? And a turn number two for the first lap. Gary Pagel and Shelford come together. Still rolling under red for some reason. 
will be very heavily frowned upon by the, the chief steward for that. Shelf in your top three, Pagel and Scott, Jack Cameron, Akin, Head, Mason Cameron and Horn in top ten. We're bunching up and we go green. 19 laps left to run here for the Greener Classic. In a turn one we go straight back to the top of the race. Jack Wimpy running pretty much the entire feature race. Oh, Jack
quick feature race. Oh, what was a superb racetrack all weekend. Massive thumbs up to the curators. Sean Butcher, Brendan Parker done a great job on this racing surface all weekend. As he climbs from the car, make some noise for your Karina Classic back-to-back -back winner, it's Aiden Raymond! <laughs> nice little board there, mate. Get pretty used to these ones, I reckon. Mate, back to back Karina Classic winner. Well done. Thanks, mate. That's awesome. Mate. Um, pretty cool racetrack to have a cush like that. Uh, it was really fun. Uh, Darren gave me a good race. Um, thought I raced him clean. Um, yeah, cushion was awesome. Mate, you lost the start uh, off the off the jump. You uh, went back to the P2, sat behind him for a bit, and then made one little hiccup, and up the inside you went and got the lead back and didn't look back from there. Yeah. I, I, picked a medium for the feature so it probably took ages to come on but I just sort of had to wait for it um, yeah, and just wait for a mistake from then on. Mate, great race, great race and great to see. Here's your prizes from the Bundaberg Speedway Sedan Club. Once again, make some noise for your feature race winner, Mr Aidan Raymond. Well, Mr Leslie, we finished one. It was, mate. One, one spot shy but uh, hey, what a feature race. 
was good to watch. I actually thought Aiden had just drive away from me and I sort of started catching him again. I was getting a bit um, anxious and then we caught lap traffic and that was the end of that. But it did look like you were pulling in a couple of tenths each lap in the last ten laps or so. And uh, I was going to say, you get a bit excited at that point, you thought you had a crack? My car was too tight for the start, so it was getting better and better and the whole line was the way to run, so it's good. Right, like you said, finish the feature race, P2, the Creator Classic, congratulations. Thanks, mate. There he is, second place for the Creator Classic, Darren Lester. Third place tonight, wasn't a boring race for you, Mick Shelford comes home with third for the Creator Classic, make some noise for Mick Shelford. Thank you, Mick. That looks like hard work, oh, mate. <laughs> yeah, we are in the wars earlier on, got spun early, but uh, come back and held off the third, well done. Yeah, no, we, uh, we started coming on there mid-race and, you know, the yellows come on or the red come on for that little bit there and we sort of never got back to it into it, but congrats to these two guys, they were, they were gone. Hey, at the end there, you had Brennan Scott on your back bumper for the last, seemed like, ten laps. Held off a third place, but that would be uh, pretty nervous, I bet. Yeah, I could hear him there and I just tried to get in the rhythm and, you know, stay on that bit of a push around the top there and, yeah, we were good enough to, to hang on. Hey, well, thanks for coming out to Corona and, uh, Great to have you out here for third place, what up? Yeah, thanks very much, and thanks to the Corinna Speedway and all the volunteers that put this show on. It's great to see you, and I'd love to come back. Can't wait. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time, make some noise for your 21-22 Corinna Classic Motorbikes and Empyrean!